I've always kind of been really interested in technology in general, even in medical school, and it seemed like the technology just had to catch up to the use cases that it could be used for for medicine. So I always sort of thought that this was a, an idea that was waiting to happen. I was looking at my insurance's website, they gave me a list of benefits, and they said, if you'd like to see a doctor right now, uh, you can through this app. And I realized, well, maybe if I can see a doctor there that they're interested in uh, having doctors uh, on their platform. I think overall it's, it's really improved my quality of life. I have uh, a wife and a six month old and um, certainly being able to practice virtually uh, helps free up some time where I can spend more time with them and not, not be at a physical location. I thought it was important when I started a virtual practice to be able to reach as many patients as possible. So I ended up applying for a number of different state licenses so I could see patients all over the country, not just in my home state. So I would definitely recommend that any doctor that wants to start a virtual practice uh, to apply for other state licenses. I think there are aspects of telemedicine where it can actually be a better experience for the patient compared to even seeing a doctor live, as opposed to a patient having to take time out of their day and physically come to an office, potentially wait in a waiting room. With a virtual consult, the doctor is right there, there's no waiting, patients love it. Usually at the end of my consults, they'll say, wow, that was so easy, that was great. End to end, it's actually a very easy process. I think it's one of the most streamlined, easy um, online applications I've used, actually. I don't think anyone could have imagined how, how quickly the expansion of technology playing a role in medicine really would be. I think that's really where the future of practicing medicine is. Patients really love it. The response has been fantastic.